A sprinter runs the 100-yard dash in 9.95 seconds. What's the runner's speed in kilometers per hour? Well, we want the units, kilometers per hour. Again, this is a complex unit, so we want to take the 100-yard dash in 9.95 seconds and set it up so that distance, kilometers, is what the distance we want. So we're going to take 100 yard and we're going to put time, because we want time in hours on the bottom, we're going to put 9.95 seconds on the bottom. So we're going to set it up that way. We're going to eventually change yards into feet, into meters, into kilometers. And there's other ways of doing that. And then we're going to take seconds, change it to minutes, and then change that to hours. Okay, so let's get started. We can do seconds. That will go on top, minutes on the bottom. So we know that one minute is 60 seconds. And then we're going to, uh, we just got rid of seconds. So now minutes will go on top and hours will go on the bottom. And we know one hour is 60 minutes. So now we have converted seconds into hours and they're on the bottom where we want them. That's perfect. So now we can go and change yards. We want those on the bottom uh, across so they will cancel. And then we can put feet up here. We know there's three feet in one yard. And then we're going to take, um, we want to get rid of feet and get meters. We have a conversion for that. One meter is 3.28 feet. And then we can go from meters into kilometers. And guess what? Now it's on top. So if, if you get things upside down, sometimes you just have to start over. But we got, we got hours on the bottom and kilometers on top. I'm going to put a 1 in front of kilo because that's my prefix. And then I'm going to substitute 10 to the third for kilo. All right, so my setup is all good. So I'm going to take 100 divided by 9.95 times 60 times 60 make sure we're not forgetting anything, times 3, divided by 3.28, divided by uh, 10 to the third is 1,000. So it will be easier to put it in our calculator that way. So 100 divided by 9.95 times 60 times 60 times 3 divided by 3.28 divided by a thousand is 33. Now, how many sig figs do we have? So a hundred yard, we're going to call that exact because it was exactly a hundred yards as given. This is three sig figs, 60 and 60. Those are exact numbers. This is exact. This is three sig figs. So we're going to have three significant digits. So it comes out to 33.1 kilometers. Per hour.